I'm Steve Barnes of the Times Union, and we're here with Tim Gates, executive chef the Charles F. Lucas Confectionery and Wine Bar in Troy. The original plan for the wine bar projected a lot of platters of cheese, cured meats, and desserts. But as the menu expanded, Gates began making more things in-house. One of the most popular is proven to be hummus. He makes about five gallons every week. Hummus is a Middle Eastern spread or dip, usually based on chickpea. While many prefer dried beans to canned for other dishes, veteran hummus makers like Gates swear by canned chickpeas, which help ensure a consistent texture every time. The only essential piece of equipment is a food processor with a large bowl. Prep your ingredients, throw them in the bowl, add the chickpeas and most of the olive oil, give it a spin, then continue adding olive oil until the desired consistency is reached. Spices vary by country, region, and even family, but constants are lemon juice, garlic, and tahini, a paste made from sesame seeds. You need only half a cup of tahini for this recipe, but a jar of it will last for months in the refrigerator. After the hummus is pureed, pour it into a mixing bowl and stir in cilantro leaves. If you make more than you'll use in a week or so, freeze the remaining hummus in an airtight container, adding a film of olive oil over the top before putting on the lid. After it's thawed, give the hummus a stir, and it should be just like the day you made it.